All right, I am playing a game here called Skatebird, um, which is about a bird who skateboards on like a tech deck or something. And uh, a friend of mine sent me this. It's on Kickstarter right now. It is. It was funded like immediately. They weren't asking for a ton of money. It was like twenty something thousand dollars, I think. Um, which sounds like a lot, but for a game, that's really not that much. Uh, so this game exists and is probably going to come out. There are stretch goals to get like a you know different sort of modes and a career and all that type of stuff. Um, I did not back it yet. This is a free demo you can get right from their Kickstarter page. Um, so I thought I would just test it out, show you guys what's going on with this game. Maybe you're into it, maybe you're not. It is what it is. Um, but it's supposed to be like a Tony Hawk style game in the future, you know, like having to go around the, the levels and collect stuff and that type of thing. So I will show you all the tricks that you can do. Um, the controls are the same as Tony Hawk. Oh, I'll, I will do that later. I will try to do, well, I'm going to do it now because I'm stuck. Okay. All right. So down flip, pop shove it. Looks kind of weird, but all right. Uh, kick flip. Uh, kick flip. There's a heel flip. Oh, there we go. It's it's kind of weird. Like it wants you to use the the joystick to do your tricks, but I have like uh, the mode on my controller. I can switch it to uh, use the D-pad instead. Um, but it doesn't work 100% perfectly. All right, and there's the impossible. There is a huh a kick flip. Where is okay? There is an inward heel flip, kind of like it's technically an inward heel flip. It's not wrong, but it looks a little weird. Uh, that was it said hard flip. There we go. Like it. I don't even know what that is. Like it starts to spin backside, which is the wrong way, and then it just kind of stops. And sometimes you spin instead. Like, I don't know. Um, yeah, it looks like it spins backside. There are also varial kick flips and varial heel flips. There we go. Technically correct. This looks weird. Varial heel flip. There you go. Also technically correct, but it looks weird. So uh, there's grabs. There's just one where you use your beak, which is kind of cute like I do like the style of this game the idea that you're floating around and you can flap your wings to fall oh crap I'm in trouble now all right so I fell if I hit the menu button I'll fly back to the table but there's a very good chance that I will not yeah um so this has happened every time I've played the game except for once it actually brought me back to the table so I am going to have to restart the game, unfortunately. I will be right back. Okay, I am back, um, and I am a different bird this time, which is cool. Uh, I've played as, I think, three different birds so far. I'm going to try to set a, oh, safe point is what that is, but all right, I don't know. Maybe that would have worked to teleport back when the game didn't want to reset me correctly, but uh, anyway. So, um, there's a handful of tricks. Um, it does not work super well, but I do love the style of it. I like the idea that everything's really small. It's like uh, your tech deck park when you were, oh crap. Oh good, all right, I'm still in, I don't know where I was. Um, you know, like this, a rail made out of pencils and all that, like we probably all did that. I never tried to grind straws though, like that doesn't work. Um, but I, I do like the graphic style of it. I think it's pretty cool. Um, I like that it's birds, like, you know, something that was small. Ugh, come on, I'm stuck here. It had to be something small that could potentially ride around on a tech deck. And I've I've seen people put pet birds on tech decks and stuff. So, I don't know. It's kind of a cool idea. Um, I hope the animation gets better, of course. But let's try to do the high score now. So there's a guy over here. All right. All right, so to do the challenge, you have to ollie. Now, the big problem with the scoring at this point, and obviously, like, this is super early. I'm not going to complain too much about how it works, but you see in the bottom there's my combo meter, the 6x. Oh, well, it just went away, but if you bail while that's still going, you lose your whole line. It's like kind of like in, in skate where instead of doing uh, combo lines, you get, uh, like, a line going. Oh, come on and uh, but in this if you bail before you land before the timer runs out you lose all the points So I only have to get 2,500 points, but it took me a lot of tries. Well, I haven't actually beat it I've tried I think three times to beat it and I couldn't because I would always bail before I got the points in so I have enough points right now 
I just have to wait it out and do nothing. All right, I did it. I did great. Thank you. Um, yeah, like, but still, this is super early. If you spin, it doesn't care. Like, you don't get any points for spinning, supposedly. It said in the little uh, document you can get. Um, although it looks like it... Oh, yeah, there's no points for it. It just says that you did it. Also, um, if you're if you're watching this, devs, it's not called a twist. It's called a spin. Um, if you twist, you can twist back the other way. That's kind of a different thing. Um, I'm sure there's going to be a lot of... A lot of work done with all that kind of stuff. Um, but let's see. So this guy wanted like 10,000, I think. Oh, I'm, I'm doing the other one again. Let me just crank that one out. And then I'm going to try to... I'm going to try to beat that better one. All right. Oh, yeah. I, I can show you all, all the grinds. But all right. So I think that was a crook. Okay, we got no slides. We got a crook. Um, can I start that mission? Hello? Ugh. Something kind of different, like in, in the Tony Hawk games, if you're stationary and you turn, you will actually spin slightly. Um, in this game, you just kind of lean, you know, like you turn the trucks, but you, since you aren't moving, you don't actually go anywhere. Um, it's a little bit different. It's taken some getting used to. Um, also, there are different modes of difficulty. If you fire up the console, you can like make it easier or something, but... I haven't had much need to do that yet. Um, not that I'm... Oh, see, now my, my total score for that is still at zero because I bailed right there, um, which sucks. <laughs> not that it's going to do anything if I beat it. It's just going to say you did a great job or whatever. But, you know, it would feel nice to actually accomplish something both in the game and in my life. So I'm going to try to do a gazelle flip indie... Oh, oh, over-rotated. Oh, good, I lost all my score. I keep trying to land in a manual, but that's not a thing. Stalls are, which, who cares? I mean, it's cool that you can do it on stuff and not just on coping. Uh-oh. <laughs> Come on, land over there. Oh, no. Oh, hey, 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 it worked. Cool, all right. I did not want to restart again because I'm going to have to resync my audio and all that, and that's just no fun. Um, Can I do a loop? Nope. I am not going to get this high score. I'm sorry. Um, I know I said that I didn't have much of a need to put it on easier, but I feel like that's more of a scoring issue and not a difficulty issue. All right, let's see if there's any more tricks. I did no slides and I did crooks. Are there like 50-50? Okay, sure. Oh, boy. <laughs> Ugh. Well, oh, oh, I'm going to throw up. Oh, okay. Okay, so I did not get that, but that's all right. Let's see, what else? So I did land, what, Mindy? What was that? I was like doing flips, but I wasn't even holding anything other than the B button. Um, I think this has some potential, maybe. But the thing that I'm most excited about is that, you know, I played a, a new skateboarding game uh, just a couple couple days ago oh man and i immediately found another one so like there's this there's session there's uh skater xl there's um there's a game that some devs sent me that i didn't try yet where it's like tony hawk but you're on boats where you like it's like a really small boat not like a, a wakeboard although maybe it should have been i don't know but you're like on a boat and you do kickflips and backflips and stuff like, there is clearly... I'm trying to get up here. I know there's something up there because I teleported up there once. Um, there's clearly a want for some skateboarding games. So I really hope that a serious professional level studio starts making something. Let me just try to teleport again, see if I land somewhere cool. Um, oh, same spot. I guess not. Um... Not that I am not looking forward to those other games, but I just mean like a really thorough experience with a full career mode and, you know, like actual pro skaters in there and all that type of stuff. Clearly people want it because they're trying to make it. So I would love to see that get done. Uh, skate 4 or something like that. Um, oh, no. Come on. Oh, you started me. Okay. All right. All right. Did I do it? Oh, all right. <laughs> Come on. All right. That was close. 
Um, yeah, but I, I just really like the style of this. Like, you can look around the room and you see stuff around in, in the level. Like, you can't get over there and it doesn't do you any good to go there, but it just gives you more of a taste of, like, you know, you're not in this tiny room. You're actually in, like, a full-size room on the table. I just, I, I just kind of like it. I don't like how that ramp is. <laughs> oh, no. All right, I hit it before I hit the ground. I think that might be the secret to teleporting back successfully before you get stuck. Um, all right. Uh, so I, I assume you'll you'll be able to like customize your character because there are there are a bunch of, oh, come on. I'm just trying to go up that ramp. I know there's nothing up there. I'm sure there's not, but I just want to do it. Okay, all right, here we go. I'm gonna land this. It's gonna be super clean. Nope, I am gonna get stuck in a crack again. I am, okay, here we go, all right. I'm seriously gonna throw up if I play this game very long. All right, no, 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 Ugh. Come on, you're a bird, why are you stuck? You can fly. It would be kind of cool if they did, why do I keep like doing primos? Um, it would be cool if they did more with the fact that you're a bird. Like right now, it's just is, I think it's just your excuse for why you're not falling faster. Because, you know, like, no matter how small you scale it down, you would still fall the same speed. So, like, to do a kickflip on a tech deck, for example, is much... It's the same speed as doing a one-inch high kickflip on a skateboard. Like, it's really, really fast. So having it be a, be a bird just lets you slow that down because you can float. Just get over there. Um, but it, it'd be cool if there was more bird-centric stuff just to give it its own flavor. Because we've had skateboarding games. So... It would be cool to just be its own thing. Oh, I, I didn't go over there. There we go. I got something new. Although I keep thinking that reflection is a hole in the ground that I'm going to fall through. Backside heel. Oh, nice. Come on. Yeah, so there's fake thrasher. Was it? it says like thrusher or something. Oh, I got camera controls. Yeah. Uh, how to find chicks. Get it? Ah, birds. Bird theme. You're feeling it. Um, yeah, I don't know <laughs> what else there is to show. I'm going to try again at that 10,000 point thing. And I'm going to try to not uh, be distracted the whole time and actually do it. But I've really shown you about all that I can find in this game. There is a mini, like a tutorial screen in the beginning that tells you what the controls are. But aside from that, that's really all there is. All right. 10,000 points. I got 120 seconds to do it. I've got zero points, and the camera is stuck. Come on. Oh. All right. Ugh. Turn. Yeah, it's hard to explain what the turning is like when you're not moving. It just doesn't do anything, and it doesn't feel quite right. How do I know which direction I'm going? I felt like I was supposed to go the other way. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do some sick vert lines. Mix up some tricks. Do some 540s and stuff. Oh no, uh, I was stuck between and I thought I could get another one. So now I got zero points on that whole line again. All right, I got 270 points. I need to just land some of these combos, but it's tough to not uh, not risk it. Come on, I didn't get any air. I was supposed to get air. It wasn't my fault I landed sideways. And again, like it says on the screen right there, there's going to be bugs. Like, yeah, it's very, very early. This was just a Kickstarter demo to show you the concept. So, like, I'm not going to be mad when things don't work. I mean, I'm going to be mad, but I'm not going to be... I'm not going to think it deserves it or anything. All right, let me just let that... Did that count? All right, it counted. I think this might be possible. It might be possible. Come on. Oh, almost under-rotated. Ooh, all right. Ooh, that was like off axis. Come on, back to zero. That has got to change, and I'm sure it will. Oh, come on, turn, turn. Ooh, all right. I've got 13 seconds. All right, this isn't going to happen, is it? Well, if I do a couple of flip tricks per air and a grab. Oh, yeah, I don't have to be spinning because spinning doesn't count. What am I doing? I did it. Hey, hey, 
I'd have to check the replay to see if I actually did it, because it seemed like I wasn't that close. But I forgot that the spins don't count, of course. Um, alright, so I swear I did a couple of different grabs when I was doing all... What was that? I, I did... It, it was like a manual. Oh, they, there is a manual. You have to hit uh, down and B. Oh, this is just a grab, but I'm balancing it. Okay, can I land from vert in a manual? No, it does not like that. Probably because it's the same control as doing a grab. So you do a grab right as you're landing. All right, let's try to land this one in a manual. If I time it right, no. Okay. But does it care about combos? Like if I do a kickflip, wait, what did I just saw? Oh, there's a, another hidden guy I didn't see. Can I do, oh, oh. Man, this is tough. Okay, so you can't even land from flat in a manual because you'll just do a grab and bail. So you have to do a manual from flat. What happens if you bail? Like, I'm not even balancing. No, I landed even if I bailed. Okay. Very strange. I'm not sure what to make of that one. Oof, or that. I'm I'm honestly getting sick playing this. I've that's not saying much. There's a lot of like anything first person I can play for like 20 minutes before I start to feel sick. Um, which sucks. And I don't want to have to take like motion sickness pills every time I play a video game. This one, like, you know, they can tweak the camera and make it work. There's nothing about this style of game that would make me sick, obviously, because I do nothing but play skateboarding games all day. Um, but yeah, this particular one, not feeling great at the moment. But yeah, that's Skatebird. Uh, if you want to play it, go on their Kickstarter and download it and you'll get this exact demo file. It doesn't have to install or anything. You just kind of double click it and open it up. It's like 150 megs, I think. Um, so you can check that out if you want. Of course, you can back it if, if you feel like it. I probably won't. I might check it out if it gets a final version um, someday. But uh, so far, I'm not seeing a whole heck of a lot that I would want to back at the moment but i do wish them the best and i hope it turns out great because i of course love skateboarding games and i would love for this to have a full career mode and all that stuff that they're talking about and i would love for it to be the modern day replacement for the tony hawk games um but yeah uh check it out if you want that'll be it from me for right now and i'm hoping to do some more stuff in the near future i will of course report on any weird skateboarding games that i find but uh, just stay subscribed and hang in there. I got more on the way for you in the very near future. Thank you for watching. See you next time.